The forum on the theme of rediscovering the agribusiness gold mine had panelists from the financial sector, academia, and the agricultural sector. A critical point that ran through the conversation was the need for collaboration from all state actors linked to the agricultural sector to maximize efforts to harness opportunities that exist. Chrissy Kobo is the CEO of Gesau. It works, you need road network. You need communication. Exactly. You need weather reporting systems. You need research. Exactly. You need health. Exactly. Okay. Mm -hmm. uh, you, I mean, the various, look. Let me give you an example. We bring in a lot of agricultural products. We know countries, in the normal times, would find in, find ways to help producers export these things, and the various export subsidy exactly. regimes and so forth. We have in this country, the Ghana International Trade Commission. We should always look at issues of anti-dumping and so forth. How would we be using them? Exactly. So they all have an impact on the sector. Mm -hmm. And unless, I said, we have a holistic yeah. approach. And we should be clamoring for that as agriculturists. That how do we coordinate? Yeah. How do we ensure that's coherence? Exactly. That road, if road is in a road in a certain area where we, we agree that this is a designated area for this value chain, how do we ensure that road network goes there? The issue of a lack of interest of the youth in the agricultural sector remains a crucial matter of concern. Chief Executive Officer of Eden Tree, Catherine Krobo Eduse, is convinced the narrative must change. If you grow up with your parents mm. and their farmers and they've been using cutlass and wool, would you be interested to do the same thing? No, especially when you have gone to school. Yes. You're not going to go to school go to university and want to come back exactly. and use cutlass and all. Mm. There's no way. Yes. So let us design modern demonstration farms, you Thank know, you. irrigation, mm. yes. drones, yes. okay, yes. Uh, tractors, yes. small implements, exactly. planters. Thank you know, you. we can't have women with children on their backs still yes. planting yes. into their mm. holes. Mm -hmm. Take carrot, for instance. Carrot is a difficult crop to cultivate. The seeds are tiny. Exactly. And the crop goes, grows into the ground. So when you are planting manually, you need to figure out the uh, amount of space mm. that you leave for the cow to be able to grow. Addressing the issue of financing for the sector, the head of agribusiness at APSA Bank, William Nete, believes there ought to be innovative ways of tackling such issues. Are we able to put these farmers together in, in groups? We do mm. that when there's a project and the money comes to them, they farm, and then once the project is off, the groups collapse, and that is it. Mm. Are we able, through the various ministries, I know the Ministry of Food and Agriculture is doing some work to put groups together, but beyond the groups, are they able even to become an association? Are they able to become a force? And you, you hear you know, some of them talk as groups, but really on the ground, are we able to, to do that? And if you are able to do that, then you have these groups that can, that can approach a financial institution. How many of these groups can approach a financial institution based on their balance sheet, based on what they've been able to achieve? All they do is that, come and give us money. You, you go there, it, it becomes a challenge. So we need to fix that. Hmm. And, and gradually, like has been said, shift from the smallholder farmers into uh, uh, larger farms. Despite the challenges in the sector, are there opportunities to take advantage of? Yes, the opportunities are we have, for example, mm. maize, soya bean, and then uh, rice. Mm. These are top notch crops that respond to external inputs. That is, you use the right, uh, uh, right varieties, mm. targeting at the right ecology, also looking at the uh, input requirements in that range. For example, maize. We produce maize varieties and hybrids mm. more than any other African crop country in the West Africa. Wow. Yes. And we've won awards under this, uh, under this bill and getting uh, for best breeding and also dissemination. Mm. These are climate smart varieties.